Peace, it's your brother Larry. Welcome to part two of my acrylic paint comparison. In this video, we're gonna actually be doing some live painting, some experimenting, and some blending on the actual canvas. If you're more interested in direct color comparison, charting and data, pricing and all of that stuff, be sure to check out the first video. Once again, in this video, the paints that we're gonna be comparing are Master's Touch, Utrecht, and Golden. Y'all stick around. As I said in the last video, Master Such has been my bread and butter since probably about late 2019. I love the concentrated, heavy feel of the paint, and it's by far the cheapest of the three. And on top of that, the tubes are priced by the size, not by the color. If you go back and look at my first video, let's just say Golden, for example. Golden might have a primary color that is $10, and then a mixed color that is $17 a tube. So overall, it's unbeatable at this price point. I can't quite explain it, but where Utrick has the edge is in its blending. You can get such gorgeous browns from blending the complementary colors. Here is another project I recently completed where I only use Utrick when I noticed that the other two brands gave me a greenish color when trying to mix the blue and orange to make a brown. It definitely has the lightest body of the three, and I felt that I had to do more layers to get the effect that I wanted. And last, but definitely not least, is Golden. I don't know how this paint has such a heavy body, but it doesn't feel chalky at all. It's very smooth. It blends easy, has vibrant colors, and it gets the job done with the least paint layers. If you can stomach the price, I would definitely recommend giving Golden a try. To sum up both videos in the most simple manner possible, based on the quality, the price, and the real world application, I would have to say Golden is the best. And yes, it's worth the high price point. Now, while Master Touch is an alternative at a much lower price point, you're going to have to spend extra time layering to get the desired effect. And while I do believe Utrecht is a good and usable brand of paint, it's just far too expensive for the results. As always, I appreciate y'all watching. Go ahead and leave me a like on the way out, and I'm going to catch y'all in the comments section. Later on.